Listen, if you want to make a living or make money or have a side hustle that involves content creation, there is nothing more important to your success than your portfolio. Anybody that's telling you anything differently is not making a hundred percent living doing this. And there is a great chance that your portfolio probably suck. Today, that's what we're gonna talk about. Stay tuned. What's going on guys? My name is Ty Turner. I am the owner and creative director of Flashville Media, a production company based out of Dallas, Texas. And if this is your first time on this channel, this channel is about one thing and one thing only, making money with your passion, period. The other channels will show you how to take better pictures and do all that cool stuff. I'm going to show you how to put food in your kid's mouth, period. Now. Listen, I am a former army combat photographer. I am used to being in a unit full of photographers. I wanna say 90 to 100 different photographers with access to a million dollars or millions of dollars worth of gear. Everybody had five D Mark IIs at the time. In fact, you probably had multiple depending on your unit. One thing that I really learned how to do while in the military was understand the importance of standing out with your work. Anybody who told you that a video portfolio is just a look at me real, obviously do not understand the importance of a video portfolio for your business, your brand, and yourself. Nothing will set you apart more than a good video portfolio. And I can guarantee you, if your video portfolio consists of your favorite clips set to music, it is trash. I'm sorry, I'm telling you this because I rock with you and I want you to get that bag. It's enough money out here for everybody. But I can promise you, if you took your best looking shots and you put them on a timeline to your favorite song or whatever, it is trash. And it's not landing you the clients it could be. I'm not saying it doesn't work. I'm saying you could possibly land a lot more clients. For me, the moment I changed my demo reel, my pockets skyrocketed. Nothing has helped me more than having a dope demo reel. And that is the reason why it was my first course. It was the biggest thing, the biggest jewel that I wanted to share with people was how to make an effective demo reel because all they taught me in video production school was to get your best clips and throw them on a timeline and send it to people and it don't work like that. Those are, those demo reels work back when everybody didn't have access to the latest and greatest gear. When they wanted to see the fact that you may have worked on set for a news crew, or you may have done this or you may have done that. Clients nowadays judge you off your ability to tell a story. And if you can't tell your story, how do you expect someone to hire you to tell their story? There is no story you know better than your own. And the course that I put out really go into detail about what you should be putting in your demo reel, like what it should consist of. And it is just leaps and bounds away from what you think should be in the demo reel. And I'll give you an example. I'm not trying to, you know, I'll give you an example. A lot of people don't include behind the scenes footage on their demo reel. Well, why would you do that? Because it places you at the scene of the murder. It places you at the scene of creation. It shows that you had a significant part in creating that final result that you're presenting as work you've done. That is very important to big clients. Small clients don't care. People spending $200 don't care. A client that's spending $10,000 care because they want to make sure that when their company writes you this big check, that you are actually the person that's created the content that they're paying for. 
and not somebody who downloaded dope images or dope shots off the internet and presented it as a bogus resume because that happens a lot. A lot of clients have been burnt paying big lump sums to people who are not capable of providing. So your demo reel should, should show that you're capable of providing this service at this level of quality and showing behind the scenes footage or a progress of, if you're doing animation, showing start, starting from wireframe all the way to final product to show that is something that only the person who created it can provide. That's why you need to understand what it takes to make a dope portfolio. Listen, let me, in fact, look, I'm going to show you what my portfolio used to look like. In case you think this is gonna be your way out. We'll see. Facebook and Twitter called Jump Burger. It's never been done before. Five day trip for two to Hawaii. Welcome to McFarland Orthodontics, where we make simply spectacular smiles. From the moment you walk in the door, we're gonna teach you how to be scrum. Now, I landed some clients with that portfolio. People thought it was dope, people liked it. But when my portfolio switched to this, my company skyrocketed. Take a look at this portfolio. Image is everything. That's why the best way to communicate and engage with your clients is with video and high quality imagery. In a world full of video creators and photographers, there are very few content creators that understand how to create content that not only tells your story, but is designed to specifically communicate to your audience. To increase engagement, promote call to action with maximum ROI. Flash Film Media was founded by Army Combat content creators with a background in psychological operations. Based out of a Special Operation Command, our journey started under harsh conditions with demanding deadlines. During our time in service, we worked alongside our nation's past two presidents, as well as multiple high-ranking government officials, creating content at the highest level. We took our experience and transitioned into the commercial sector, becoming one of the most trusted production companies in the DFW area. Our client list is a great example of our ability to create gripping content for the purpose of training, communication, event capture, promotional, and even testimonial content, consistently offering the best value in the market. We live a one-word creed, flexicution. That's the ability to be flexible and execute projects with great attention to detail, providing unmatched success rates with the parameters of your budget and deadline. From the photo side of things, we produce stunning imagery, from eye-popping company headshots to product photography, unrivaled by our competition. We offer magazine-level corporate event photography, designed to not only tell the story of your event, but capture the moment. We provide commercial photography tailored to the culture of your brand, specifically targeted for social media marketing. If video is what you need, we offer unmatched value. Bring us the idea and our team of multimedia directors, instructional designers, and copywriters will provide a fast turnkey solution from the beginning to the end. We also provide course and concept design, script writing, location scouting, 
on-screen talent acquisition, props, makeup, and wardrobe down to the color palette of your brand. We provide highlight, explainer, and communication videos that reflect the tone of your brand. We also produce engaging testimonial and interview style productions intended for your target audience. When your image is on the line, there's only one company to trust. Flash Film Media, inspired by passion, driven by results. For a free quote, please visit our website, flashfilmmedia.com, or give us a call at 972-863-2086. In a world of iPhones, in a world where everybody's buying cameras, in a world where you can get great 4K quality for $12.95 from Blackmagic, in a world where everybody has access to gear and cameras and everybody's walking around with a camera in their pocket, your video quality is not why a client is going to work with you. Putting clips on a timeline to music only show your video quality maybe your ability to edit, but nothing will land you a job faster than your ability to tell a story. That is why I created the course, because the course talks about how to tell your story, what you should be using, what should your mindset be, how many portfolios you need, where should they be displayed, you know, what you need to make sure you're capturing moving forward with jobs that you may not have captured before that can help your portfolio. Those are things that are extremely important to your success. And if you don't understand the importance of your ability to tell a story, you will not make it. iPhones are closing the gap on your ability to properly expose the image, to get things in focus, your ability to provide dynamic range. iPhones are closing that gap. It's not about that no more. And if you don't understand that, you won't be around long. And that's just that's just me being real with you. Like if you can't understand the importance of the storytelling side about, you know, behind what you do in every aspect, even in photography, there is a way to tell stories with images. You have to be able to do that. You have to be able to draw a viewer's attention in a direction you want to based off your images. That's something that we were taught in Denfos or in the military when capturing images, especially on the battlefield or in war. Where do I want to draw the attention of my viewer for this image that may be displayed in Time Magazine? If you don't understand that, you will not make it and i'm just being 100 with you you won't make it your new camera body and your set of lenses eventually they're going to get ate up by iphone and that's just the truth they're going to get ate up by a point and shoot they're going to get ate up by an ipad or a tablet or a gopro eventually like you can't defeat the algorithm you can't defeat um a computer's ability to think or outthink you. We're getting self-driving cars. You think they can't invent a camera that can really, you know, get a better picture than you can produce, that can decide what the subject matter is and decide where the focus needs to be and decide what the exposure needs to be and, desi and, and decide the angle and the composition. If you don't think that that is coming, you are asleep at the wheel. Go listen to podcasts like Sleepwalkers. It will wake you up. You have to have the ability to tell a story. That is something that is just not in every content creator you come across. You have to have that ability. That is why I created that course. That is why it was so important that that was the first thing I did because that's what helped me excel more than anything, more than my website, more than my brand name, more than my location, more than me spending money on advertisement. It was getting in front of people and convincing them that they couldn't go nowhere different or get anything better than what I'm presenting them based off my ability to explain who I am, what I do, and why you need to choose me. So, I'm sorry it's a long-winded video, but it is very, I just, I just got out of a chat room or a message board just talking to people who just don't grasp the idea of the importance of a portfolio. 
They think it's just a look at me real, look at me real. If you're going to apply for a job and your resume is trash, but your portfolio is great, you will have a better chance of getting that job if it was the reverse. If you had a trash portfolio and a great resume. For content creators, there isn't a degree on the wall that solidifies you, that shows that you are great at what you do. All you have is your demo reel, period. So your demo reel needs to bring it. And again, if it's just colorful, colorful pictures and great music, a person watching doesn't feel an emotional connection to you or your ability to do what they need to do. And you're just another person with pictures. So I'm going to, you know, say that to say this, take your demo reels more serious. If you're lost in the sauce, if you don't get it, shameless plug, but here's a link to my course that talks about what you need to do to create a successful portfolio. If you don't, man, good luck. I, I, you know, listen, I can lead you to water, but I can't make you drink. And I often see so many people struggle with spending money to bring all of this traffic to their website. They're getting in front of decision makers and they don't understand why they're not being chose for the job. And their only thing they know how to do is lower the price, lower the price, lower the price. They want to be the cheap guy. They Instead of working on being the guy that offers enough value so that clients will say, okay, I like this guy. I'm willing to pay for it because he has convinced me that he is capable of doing what I need done and more. When you're not convincing people, the only thing you can do is say, uh, what if we take $100 off? What if I did it for this price? Maybe we should go lower than that price. And people are like, we'll get back with you. We'll shop around. If your demo, if people watch your demo reel and they still shop around, your demo reel is not good enough. Your website is not good enough. And nothing will help you land more clients and make more money than your demo reel. I just want to be really 100 with you and just be real with you. Like I, I, there, there, if you don't take nothing else from this channel, if you don't ever go to Flash Film Media or FlashFilmAcademy.com, if you're never watch anything I say other than my videos on new gear or whatever, take this tip with you and go look at what you have to offer and fix it. I guarantee you, you will make more money. I guarantee you, you will book more clients. I guarantee you, you will be a lot more successful than you currently are. All right, guys, listen, I can go on this and on and on all day. I won't hold you longer than I've held you, but this is something that I just, I had to get off my chest because there's a lot of people out here who want to do this for a living. And they think that just because they got a dope camera, people supposed to throw money at them and it don't work like that. You, you gotta, you gotta sell yourself. You gotta be able to show value and people just don't get it. They just, I'll just, I'll charge cheaper than what they're charging. And you know, and I'll get the business and it don't work like that. There's a reason why Mercedes sell cars, you know, and you got to understand just how things work. So again, I, I can talk forever on this, man. You can see that I'm passionate about just trying to help people get that bag, man. Get that bag, feed your family. Every company needs video. Every company needs photography. Every company you drive past, every plumber, every doctor, every dentist, everybody needs pictures, video. They need them on their website. They need editing. They need color. Every, every last one of them. go through your yellow pages. Every company needs video. There's not enough of us around to meet the need. And we haven't even got to the point where business owners fully understand that they need this. We're right before the website boom, where companies are like, we don't really need a website for what? And then boom, it's like you're dead if you don't got one. So I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of your day. If you got something to say, let's talk in the comments. Listen, if you are in the Facebook, post your demo reels. Let's talk about it. If you have purchased the course, there is a comment section where people who have purchased the course can talk. Post your demo reel in there. I will critique and look at them and say, hey, fix this. Let's do that. And let's learn together and grow together. And I will see you guys in the next video.